CBS4 Weather. Good morning, I'm meteorologist Dave Warren. Happy Thanksgiving. The sun's coming up. There's a few clouds out there, but if you look off the coast, uh, the clouds building. There's one or two showers. We'll keep an eye on this morning. Uh, they are staying off the coast for now. The temperatures are comfortable. Upper 60s, mid 70s there in Key West. Ray, real time Doppler, keeping an eye on these showers. They're developing up towards West Palm Beach and down through Broward, Miami Dade. Last hour, they are not moving much, but as things heat up with that sunshine, these this activity here could actually try to work its way over to the interior and pass through the area uh, this afternoon and this evening. So much of the area should stay dry, but uh, maybe a passing shower uh, mainly this afternoon. Upper 60s right now, a little comfortable, a little slightly drier. A front that came through has stalled just to our south, becoming stationary, and uh, that's really the, what dried us off just a bit here to lower the humidity uh, briefly. There's these showers. They're picked up by the computer forecast about 8 o'clock, still off the coast, but you see as things warm up, they kind of work their way to the interior. Passing shower, then a lot of activity off the coast. Area of low pressure developing here, so a lot of the, uh, the rain stays off the coast. But the wind will be picking up a bit, especially just to the north where there's a hazard for boating and a rough surf. Uh, likely that could try to push south, but I think it'll be a little calmer here here in South Florida. Here comes that wind speeds increasing just a bit, but stopping right around Palm Beach County. So two to four foot seas today. That might be increasing, though, over the next 24 hours. That northeast wind 10 to 15 knots. Warmer weather coming in before the next cold. Cold front that'll drop us into the mid 70s Monday into Tuesday.